Yes. Well. Yeah, that's, oh. that's still one heck of a placement. We got the rematch. Yeah. That's true. The, the run back Arm. for Grands. Yeah, Skarm versus Frost. Hopefully we can see Skarm. And we're not just talking to Rumback from uh, earlier in the stream, but we're talking like, I think the last time both of them played was also in Grand Finals. Winners. Or Winners Finals, you're right. Yeah. Winners Finals. <clears throat> well, no, I think I think they actually, I think they did a... Uh, I have to look a couple uh, pilot programs ago, but I think I think we actually got them in Grand. Both of them yeah, before. it might have been like two, two, uh, two ago. Or three. Yeah. The, between the two players, um, Skarm is a stronger player, in my opinion, between the two. Even though Frost is Skarm such wave. an amazing player that you see him, like, try so hard. Oh, Skarm is Yeah, but, right? I mean, <laughs> Skarm is also... I, he, Skarm is such a veteran. He, he, he's, a, he's, a, he's a good player. He's a, he's, a, he's a great Minecrafter. And he's also good <laughs> looking good at Halo. <laughs> You know? Bro, this oh, dude I in my Minecraft server, dude, I, I opened up a Minecraft server for my subscribers, and like this dude, like day one, had like almost an entire stack of diamonds. I'm like, this dude is something else. What? Yeah. I, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's possible to do that, but just you're, you're pushing it too far, man. Like, this ain't no speedrun. Exactly. Uh, we literally told him to stream, dude, this ain't speedrun. <laughs> like, let, let the other people, like, get some diamonds, please. Dang. Leave some for the like rest what, of us. Six for chunk? Uh, something like that. Uh, how's how's like how's, that. how's the town going, by the way? Uh, I actually tunnel. checked in there not so long ago. It's coming along. Uh, it's coming along. Oh, he's going Mario. Yeah, we're gonna run it back like like just like last oh, time. Oh yeah, here we go. Because I think I think the whole Roy Cromstick just wasn't really working out. It seemed like so. And Mario, on the other hand. He definitely seems to uh, be doing exactly what he needs it to do, which is uh, move. Um, one of the things that I've seen from uh, what's it called, um, Skarm, is his chic. He plays an incredible chic, like during doubles, like even one at Super Ascension. I played his chic and it was insane. Mm -hmm. Actually, I don't think he considers chic to be one of his bracket characters, but I, I have played his chic before. It's pretty nice. I've seen him play his chic in doubles too. It's, a, it's an amazing. Wow, it's just like. Uh -oh. And doing ladder combos uh -oh. taking that stock. Oh no. Good good DI. Oh. And the baby establishing that stage control. Oh unfortunate, unfortunate off stage mishap. Losing his first stock. Yeah. Because of recovery failure. Unfortunate miss mishap off stage is gonna put him down a stock. Kind of up there in percent considering that it's super early in the game, but I mean I feel like I feel like you can really make this work if you try for it. Yeah. Huh. Oh, good job catching a mid nair. Gonna put him back oh. off stage. Come on. Gonna burn that double jump. Gonna burn the double jump. Flip him off. Oh, yeah, with the cape, not with right the finger. That was, that was a five brain move right there. Like so flip, flip him off with the cape, not the finger. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's he he a... tried to space it to where he got him right over that ledge, peeking with the water. I, I oh, like how we try to aim him that way. Oh, uh, some of the PR people I miss are like Coco B Rice. Man, I, I haven't seen B Rice play in so long. Oh yeah, that's right. B Rice is such a legend with this is well. B Rice, where are you? We need you back. Yeah, MIA, yeah. Bro. Where are you, B Rice? You and MIA. Yeah, like. Can we get like um all the PR people just like in one like tournament, just like well, see how far that, that was. It. Like, that was ACSL. Yeah, I think that was his last appearance. Yeah, AC is Ooh, yeah. good last appearance. spacing on that F smash. No, but we just need an all PR, like top ten PR, like yeah. Tournament. You know, I wanted to comment on that because I'm like, you you'll only see what you just saw, um, like in the latter ends of the bracket, where like some players they're just so confident in their ability to space out options that you just saw like a whiff dash attack immediately followed by a forward smash. I believe it was a run up forward tilt, and he just knew. Yeah. He's like, yeah, you're not landing that. So I'll hit him with one of these. And it is hard for Mario to approach because, like, sorties are very difficult for Mario to play against. They can prove to be that, yeah. Yeah, but, like, once, like, Mario's come in and, like, they start to do their combos or, like, they throw, they do a fourth throw off stage and do the fair, it's it's a GG for the Marios. Like, they, they can win like that. Case in point. No matter what. Yep. Oh, wow, but the forward smash almost taking that stock right there. 
Uh oh, uh oh. I I I just started the prediction. So we don't might have to get in on oh that. Oh my goodness. I mean it's still early. Yeah, it's still yeah, early. Yeah, it's still early. So, They're both even right now. I'm going so you, I'm going all in on Skarm. Oh, I'll go all in on Skarm, why not? Oh you're gonna go all in, in on Skarm? Channel point. Yeah. Yep. I, I love the way that Skarm plays. There you go. 6,000 channel points. I swear, if I lose all 6,000 channel points, I've never played Oh, 6,000! Oh, 6,000! Oh. Jeez. And there we go, game one comes to Hey! Go. Oh my... <laughs> First step towards my, my channel 6, points secured. Points Heck yeah. Run me my 6,000 channel points back. Jeez, man. I, I, I remember, so I think uh, Cyclone went all in on... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> 20,000 20, You got 20,000 back? <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> Yeah Alright game That's 2 something. Mario vs. Crown The run back on same stage Alright let's go see what they can do Uh where is this being held? Oh this is being held at uh, Pure Esports At Pure Esports Mondays and Wednesdays as of this moment But hopefully we can get more days and Probably more locals too. Uh, yeah, I don't hopefully. think we're gonna do more days in the pilot program. We're gonna we're gonna start increasing the cap. Oh man, I miss Sink or Swim. I remember playing the Sink and Swim. Sink or Swim online. If we oh do yeah, we did that online if for we, a bit. If we do Sink or Swim, it's gonna be um, it's gonna be at our own venue. Oh, keep that. Keep in mind, everybody. You heard it. But we don't know. But we yeah, I, I literally do not know what so, Oh but that force smash just punishing it. Oh my goodness. Scarm. Scarm scarm. Man, can we get like Coco here too? Like someone told yeah. Coco, like Oh and, these, and, like, and also we're gonna we're gonna bring back the original stink from format so pools. Oh no way. Well, that's the whole that's reason why. That's, that's, the whole, that's the reason why I think it started. Like, you know, it, it, the whole thing with Simulus, according to even when he told me, is you started. You, uh, you actually you played in pools, and then you um, and then you played out. You entered bracket, right? Yeah, got in the bracket cap. Yeah. That's the sink or swim. <laughs> or swim. That's the that's the lore. I think uh, everyone that fell out of pools got into amateur. Yeah. yeah. This is a little lifesaver, you know. Oh, they totally drown. <laughs> in game, in game, in game. <laughs> oh! But that crawl side right there for that. that stock. Oh, that was the Mario side. That was something, man. Oh, it wasn't a crawl side? I thought. Oh. No, that was Mario Forward there, bro. That, that, was, that was like the alternate. That was the alternate I, ending. I, I mean, okay, last stock situation. So what the was last game? No, the, it is. I mean, oh, you know, these oh, are really oh, close. Dude, Storm is setting up right. He is going in. Yeah, he's not about to waste time. He's like, you know what? That was cool and all, but I kind of did tie up the game, and I, I want to make sure it doesn't slant in, in the opponent's favor. Oh, good oh, Jerry. Not the right percent though. He's gonna make it back Please. easy peasy. Oh man, I want this. I want this set to last for a long time. Yeah, number two going against the number one. We're gonna we're, we're seeing some amazing play. Uh, I mean, look at that. It's just baby. Sorry, Skarm has just has that control. Yeah, because I'm like I don't I don't know if this set will really go for as long as some people might think. Because and it's game. Oh no. Because like the last time we saw them play was a 3-0 for the baby, but then this last time where we just saw them play earlier today was like the exact opposite. It was a 3-0 for oh, but Mario. The Jared just, oh, Jared just. So, Coming in clutch. Yes, the baby finally taking his first stock against Farm this entire tournament. Yep, that's right. Sorry, I've just noticed something game. about the baby. First oh, did you say I stock? Just, I did said you say stock. stock? I said stock. I just assume you said game, and I agreed right away. I, I just, I just noticed something about the baby. Is he wearing like a cloak or something? Like he's wearing like a cape. Something like that. that yeah, right something like that. Okay, game three. All right, game three, Mario versus Krom again. FD. On FD, all right. 
Banger. This, this, Banger I think loop. this is a more of a Chrome stage since uh, Mario's love platforms, like triplat. Ooh, not bad. I I'm just waiting for the moment I see green Mario and uh, Yoshi's story. That's when I know it's serious. Oh, good spot dodge on that jab. Oh! <laughs> And he knew exactly what option to use that would give him enough leniency to not get punished by another one, too. Because, I mean, we're talking about Krom. If they whiff one jab and they don't get punished right away, it's about to be jab two. But yeah, he, he's well aware of that. Especially since, you know, he plays Roy, which kind of hits the same in some fashion. So, I mean, I'm, sure, I'm pretty sure he's got a good download as to where and when to punish those whiff jabs. Yeah, you, just noticed, you just noticed a little bit earlier, Skarm just doing his best to keep... The baby off stage because he just has yep. many options just to keep piling on that percentage. Ooh, oh, but that board okay, that was just taking good. that stock right there. Catching him right before you had the opportunity to grab ledge there. Down throw. Oh! Down throw into into rejection. Hold on. What happened there? Oh, Whoa! I'm sorry, just unfortunately missing that right there. Man. He's trying to get another down throw string going, but it's just not going to quite pan out as he figures it would. I, honestly, I'm surprised it's not working out that way. It seems like that would just work under any circumstance, but he just either has really good DI or is just not at the right percent, I guess. I don't know. Oh my god, double spot dodge on both down tilts? That's something. Good job. Try, try to get a little bit oh, more but precautious. The Mario combos. Yeah, didn't want to follow up right away on the jab, so he got a little bit. Too, I guess, too careful. Or it just didn't pan out there. Another forward tilt edge guard. Getting pretty consistent at those. Being consistent, but also very predictable, too. Don't forget That's that. right. Of course. Now, we've been talking about that all throughout tonight. You could have a really great option in store, but one too many times and it will get punished. Especially with someone as talented one, as one right now. There is a 56% deficit right now, and there is at it the moment. could be a bit of a struggle for. Scarm, but but the magic of Scarm, we don't know. He could do a zero to death too. He just ran right past him. What is that? He's ah. just getting cold. <laughs> He's just getting cold. Bruh. What is this neutral right now? This is kind of interesting, actually. What What is Frost doing? Oh, no. He's this setting up. Down till... He's setting up for something big oh, there. He's trying, to play like, he's trying to play like Melee Marth right now. I don't know why. They're, they're both trying to get something started here, especially the baby, I imagine, because he he's at the right percent to close this out if he can. Oh man, he is going in. Back so throw into impressive. an attempt at back air. He, he is so. Oh he no! Is... He's getting. I can't tell if he's he trying to close so it out. For this win. Oh man, he is okay. so hungry for that win. Yeah, that was something. I was like, I couldn't tell at the end if he was trying to be careful or just go absolutely in on him. Right, well, like, we, here, here, here it is again. Yeah. Yeah, you, you get See, that. Yeah. He tried going for Jer. He tried going for Jer right there. He did. And then he goes for Ford, too. I, it wasn't just in that clip, though, but I did see a, good, uh, a number of panic options that were, like, Cloud? I guess kind of alternative to what I figured he would be doing in that situation. Oh, no, no. Wait. Oh, Ken! Ken? I thought he was gonna go cloud. I, I would have been so happy to see a cloud. Just like, can one, can I get like one click, like cloud game? Like, Sam, please. Thank you. All right, so now the game with the Hadouken. But Frost going in with air, fair, up air, up air. Very much else. Uh oh. Any comments right now, Taco, about um, uh, Scarm's uh, counterpick to Ken? Uh, I mean, I, I know that he knows Ken the best out of all the characters he plays. Even though, sure <laughs> even though he likes to deny it every time I mention it to him, but it's definitely true. Oh, um, he misses a sure you. Ooh, yeah. But I guess like, uh, it could work. I'm not against it, but I do feel it's a little bit preemptive considering that he already 3-0'd with Mario solo, and he's only lost one. Or oh, actually, he's now two games now, so I'm sure he's just trying to mix it up a little bit. Last chance. Yeah. Uh oh, and I'm pretty sure he is the best hand of Arizona too. Uh, Ooh, but the most notable, yeah. Missing. True. Yeah. He was missing focus right there. Wow. 
Yeah, because I'm like, focus is good, but I'm like, if you can apply that much pressure, like like Krom can, it's not yeah, going to do a crazy to... amount. Yeah, focus, you can do so many combos with focus. And sure, you're just taking that stock right there. This stuff Shoryu on Shoryu. is so effective. I'm just waiting for a shield break from uh, Ken. I mean, from Skarm. Yeah, we might get one too, with the, with the amount of uh, pressure that's able to be applied in such a short amount of time. Because yeah, it's, it's so... Go ahead. Yeah, especially... You kind of need those moments, especially since... Uh, Skarm now needs to at least take... Um, you know, two more games. Or else he's facing a reset. Yeah. And, you know... I, I think Ross in the reset situation... Oh, oh my goodness! Ross is in the reset oh, situation has, has really performed really well. Especially with that momentum coming oh, yeah. out. So, is, he yeah. doesn't want to reset against, uh, against Ross. Oh, combo? Woo! Oh, no! Popped! Oh, I almost oh, reached my soundboard, the shield break. Yeah, yeah, I almost reached my yeah, soundboard. Yeah, there, you, you're, there you go with your shield break. Man, it's it's a it's a hard thing to know how to play against uh, a Shoto that knows footsies also because if you know yeah. how to play footsies with the Shotos, it is a very it's like a bent nail that you try to hammer in but you <laughs> can't. It's yeah. very hard. No, I mean, uh, honestly, I, I would I would like while it is definitely true, I mean, it might be the easiest for oh oh no oh, no almost okay he's still in. In, but it's Good just... recovery, but a Jer but Jer off of a roll J off of on stage. Frost, Frost, I'm tweeting out Frost right now. Frost resetting right the bracket. Okay, let's take a look at that last knock. So not quite gonna right. cut it with F Smash, so we're gonna see him recover on a stage. Uh, with a, it was a very low recovery double jump with sure um... you can. You're right, low recovery counter's not quite gonna cut it, but a roll on stage is gonna get punished by jab into back here. The Chrome class, dude. Yeah. Oh man, I do not want to lose the 6,000 points, please go! <laughs> whoa, whoa. What's popping? Did, did I just see what I thought? Oh! oh what? What? <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, hey, wait, hold on, hold on. Can we change Smash into Overcooked? Can we do like a Grand Finals? No, Overcooked, overcooked grand instead? Grand overcooked Grand Finals? No way. Like your recent into Overcooked. Oh my goodness, I. Uh... Yikes! Um, Dang. I was not expecting the switch to crash. I think the game wasn't ready for Rainbow Cruise. <laughs> <laughs> the game was like so confused. Like, wait, isn't this bracket? Uh, and then it just crashed. That's so funny, though. Yeah, honestly, I mean, we haven't. I don't think I've seen him do Ken in the past like two or three times that they played each other. So it's definitely a good mix-up. But I'm like, like, I guess to. What stage are they going on to? Oh, they're going on to small battlefield. Okay. All right, there you guys go. I'm gonna put the screen in charge because we can look at it. There you go. All right. All right, reset well, like, time. Here right, we go. Game, game one of grand finals reset. Neutral is being very fine and simple, but finally going in with some damage of uh, Frost going to, uh, doing some nares, and then cannon combos. Yeah, good strings to start it out with. Ooh, good down smash. It's gonna put him off stage. Yeah, just just something to note. This is actually the second time we've actually had a reset um, in the pilot program so far. Oh is this what? The second one? I thought there were more. Oh, I thought there were more on the resets. Though. No, there have no, there haven't been any oh. more resets. This is actually the second, only the second one. Oh, oh my <laughs> goodness! He tried oh to go goodness. crazy. He tried to go crazy on him. Scarms can is coming in clutch right now. Almost getting crown sighted right there, but barely missing it. This isn't USF four, but like I mean, he is putting in the work for it. Yeah, he is. Uh oh, uh oh. I, I need to play like more of the older. Oh, Jer. I, as I was saying, I need to play more of the older like Street Fighter games. 
Yeah, they have 30th anniversary collection on Switch. Yeah, I, I heard, like, Ficade also- Oh, nice focus right there from, uh, Scar. A really good focus right there. Yeah, like, there's a software on PC- Oh, no. As I was saying, there's a software on PC called the uh, Fightcade where it has like all like the games that you would like download and then you play with other people online instead of like buying um games yep. on Yeah. It is absolutely yeah, I'm pretty sure right. there are tournaments for it too. As far as I know, yeah. Man, I mean like to be honest, like Shotos could be a pretty good pick against Chrome. Uh if, especially if you get that advantage, you can just run for with it for miles, but on the other hand, I mean Chrom is probably the closest thing to a Shota when it comes to sorties, so... <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. It is hard to think about it, because Shotos are very fluid with their movements, and how they have to put in, like, the quarter circles and stuff, too. Yeah, but on, like, Chrom, the fall speed, the run speed, the aerials... It kind of I mean, hits like a Shoto. The only thing I can see about Chrom being... A Shoto, quote unquote, is Jair, pretty much. Yeah, I mean, oh yeah, that's true. Got like confirms off of light moves as well. Yeah. Kind of fits the criteria in my head. Oh, and there it is. The sure you can. And game one going to Skarm. Not bad. It's a, it's a good foot to start off on. It's, it's a good foot to start off on because especially like, you know, like some people might like play... Can and then they lose a bracket reset. It's like, well, kind of switch back. You know, we, we lost the bracket reset because of that. But you know, sometimes holding out in the way Skarm has it kind of pays off. That was a pretty good first game. <laughs> God, I love Twitter sometimes. What happened? I hate Twitter, Twitter sometimes. No, uh, 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 it's 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 a tweet that I saw. Oh. I I can't I can't disclose it on the stream otherwise. Uh... Wait, it was a tweet. Yeah, it was. A oh, I thought it was a Facebook. Tweet. Yeah. Let, no, let's, I, I don't use it. <laughs> let's 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 leave it there. Game two. Yeah. Let, yeah. Game, game two. two. <laughs> um. But let's I mean. The game now. I mean, the baby getting on some early damage. Oh yeah, fifty-one percent at like thirty seconds into the game. Okay. Good. Good use of focus there. As they are on Town City too, which could be an advantage. Oh for man. It could be an advantage from Krom. Uh, yeah, uh, you, you think focus in neutral against Krom can be a little bit of a predicament because like most moves are not multi hits so you can, you can take the hit. But uh, on the other hand, a, a lot of his moves can like cancel so quickly into others that like sometimes it doesn't just pan out that way. Oh, but for Ken, Ken, it could be difficult for him to like enter because of how big the stage is and like I guess the only thing that could help him is um uh, Hadoukens and stuff. Double sure you double can... sure you just taking that stock right there, nice. That's from Sean. Good spot dodge. He's not gonna be able to Oh well you know what? He got he quite almost... a bit of shield pressure out of it. Yeah, I got a lot of shield pressure and it really breaks it. As you know, might might not have gotten any percent, but it's, it's some good shield pressure Ooh. that he could probably poke through a little bit later down the line. There we go. Oh almost. Man, I I love Ken combos. They're they're really interesting. Yeah. See, cause like just just cause a Ken doesn't like break a shield right away, don't dismiss it, because like yeah. very soon afterwards they'll find themselves in the same situation, and then that additional shield pressure they did before is gonna add up, and it might even lead to a shield break down the line. You gotta think a little bit more long term when you see that pressure being applied. Yeah, no matter what, Ken Ken is like an oddball because you don't see him in like tournament. You mainly see like Terry. He's like taking over. Yeah, because Terry's, Terry's like... a very strong character when he gets go meter and like everything else. Yup. <sighs> oh, okay, he went in deep. Oh, oh dang. Dang. I'll, I'll wow. give him props. I'll give him props. I did catch uh, the I'll, tech. I'll give, I'll give props, props for that, yeah. He, he did he did land the tech though. Even though he still got dragged down. I was like, hey, that's pretty nice. Boss basically went into the, like the ninth player of Dante's Inferno. I mean I mean that would uh, that would have been really good on the last one. Yeah. I mean, uh, look, got, got, uh, got the I mean right. right now, if he did that, think about it. If he did that and Skarm won just because of an SD like that, I would be molding. <laughs> right. I would be molding. Oh my and goodness! Oh. Jack taking game that should have gone platform. Yeah, wow. I mean, here it is again. Like, paid off. You know, 
I mean, he goes in right with there. chair. Um, I think he was trying to do fair once he went off that platform, but he gets dash attack, right? That's a smart move right there, getting dash. Yeah. Um, PS2. We're, we're, Stop battle. Uh, how, how would you play this? Uh, um, smaller stage, I think it could help Skarm a bit. Because, actually, no, it's it's mixed. It's mixed for me, actually. Okay, Taco. I mean, I don't know. We, we, we kind of saw like a similar uh, stage uh, with Small Battlefield, so I don't think it'll change too much. You know, the dimensions are somewhat changed, but I, I feel like not, neither of them have really changed their approach like too drastically. So it's a little bit hard to say oh, uh, yeah. straight and away. I unfortunately don't have any set notes from it, because otherwise I would revert back to see how it performed previous stage. I don't have the right. set notes, so. You know, all we have like is part. literally right in front of us, which is, of course, an even game so far. Um, right. And, you know, let's, let's see how this plays out. Yeah, I mean, what, what you see is kind of what you've gotten all throughout the set. It's, it's been pretty even for the most yeah. part. You, well, even, one of the things that... Wait, go ahead, talk about I was going to say, like, even when the bracket reset occurred, it didn't necessarily happen for free. No, it, it was it's, definitely an uphill battle. Not, you know, even though it came out to a 3-1. Three, uh, three yeah, oh, but that backer just took that stock right there. Down to a last stock situation. So right. these were not free for uh, for debate. Yeah, it, it is hard to cover Ken. Like Ken is one of those like very confusing characters to cover sometimes because of like how he plays and like with spacing, footies, and everything else. It's kind of hard to think about. So are you just taking that stock? To This Star, is you like are, you are really good oh, with Ken. See that is just coming down right off, right off platform and just open it up right there. But, but here's the thing. I mean, Arm is not too far behind. You know, just yeah. one hit right here and it could be, it could be a quite, quite a stock. Yeah. Uh oh, uh oh. I, I, the thing that I haven't seen Skarm do a lot is like back throw with Ken because I know back throw can be very effective with Ken too. Mm, back throw, it, yeah, it's definitely good for setting up. Yeah, because I don't, I don't know about any of the. I think down throw you can set up with like uppy, right? Uh, yeah. Well, no, I, I'm not saying like it's like a like a combo throw per se, but I mean like it's good for like a positioning like off stage, for instance. Yeah, just to take a stock. Yeah. Right. I I've seen that he all all his stocks is. These past two, three matches have like been with Umpy, mainly. Yeah, that that's the tried and true. Oh. Uh, and Aomi. Oh, this is a very scary situation for Skarm right now. Oh, it's like, oh, ah, something. In a way, I think I think Skarm's like a bit of an underdog character right now. I mean, player right now. Yeah. I mean, let's, let's look at that thing again. That was a little fast. So, coming up here on ledge. Uh, just on ledge. Yeah. And the wait. Stop the read. Oh. Yeah. And then That's, back here. And I believe that was a like, short hop. He, he short hop. Because I yeah, think he, he knew. Yeah, he short focus right there. Yeah, he short hop. Joker. Joker? What? What? No way. And no. my skin with no credit? And didn't even oh, change his tag to Taco Waffle. Fortunate Taco. That's, that's, he didn't that's even change his tag to Taco Waffle. No, I'm that, kidding. That, I, he is teasing. I'm, I'm kidding though. I'm kidding though. I, I I lend him that skin. I lend him that skin. He's good. He, I I lend him my drip for chill. He is teasing you at this point. He tells you to go to the Wednesday local. And he pops up in this local. He's play, no, you know I can respect it though. He's playing Joker for me. He, he's playing in Grand's playing Joker, Joker for, for me. Yeah. He's in Grand's playing oh, Joker. Oh no, no, Grand's reset. Yeah. 
Oh, oh Chewie kind of messed up. You know I wouldn't throw a Black Reset at that. That's so smart. He gets our sent to it at the funny number of 69%. Hey, that is pretty funny. Hey. <laughs> Quite nice, though. I chuckled, 69. I chuckled. 69.6. <laughs> and if you see the percent, it kind of looks like a 9 too, so we get 69, 69. There you go. There it is. As you know, it oh, whoops. Oh, 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 no. no. See, I can tell you what happened, bro, because I was about to say, I'm like, look, 69 is the percent of opportunity. Anything can happen. But you saw the moment he went below the stage and took that 1%, he lost it. He lost that clutch factor, and that's why he has deep. Oh. 69 is like the American dream. No matter exactly. what, if you can accomplish with 69, you'll 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 win the game no matter what. Exactly. Oh, a footstool. Footstool. All right. Gosh, I need I need to go to one of these local. Okay. Just, oh. Interesting. Oh, this is actually scary now. Just think of Ooh, oh, oh, no! No! Oh, no the spacing was just right to where you didn't have to exactly chromicide and still manage to sneak a stock in there. Yeah, uh, here's the thing. Uh, Skarmon is tournament stock now. You know, maybe That's absolutely right. Maybe could win this. But, you know what? Oh. Skarmon! There we go with Rebel's Guard, but too late. He, uh, even though he does crazy. get... Oh, nice from Skarm. Oh. Hopefully, we could see a comeback with Skarm. Oh, oh no. no. Dang, dude. I, well, Dang. I am not gambling anymore. Now, I listen. Now, listen. I, 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 lent him, I lent him my skin for that game, but unfortunately, he took with that my gameplay where he just unfortunately whipped down being neutral. Oh, man. I do that all the time. That, I didn't think it would take that, that much away from me. <laughs> yeah. I, I just... I'm not even talking about the set. I'm I'm sad that I lost over six thousand channel points in that. Yeah, list. that'll definitely happen. <laughs> yeah, that'll and, definitely and, and, happen. You know what? And you know what? Nobody voted for uh for the child. Nobody. He. he everybody who voted for for fry hate like. <laughs> oh my god! Like every that that I I I don't get that. You know. Wait, did everybody? Ah, uh, yeah. That's oh. something. That that's that for you, man. Yeah. No, it's. I mean, it is what it is. But like, I'll say this though, because I mean, we did touch on this earlier. So when they played yeah. earlier today, it was a clean 3-0 for Skarm. The last time they played in uh, Grand Finals, I'm pretty sure it was Grand Finals. The last time they played each other, like in a previous uh, tournament, that was a clean 3-0 for uh, the baby. So it, it oh, was really? very cool to get to see a much more even, a much more. Uh, um, I guess. Not just not just varied like with the results, but just like varied in terms of like you know counterpicks on Skarm's part and stuff like that. A lot more um, engaging to sit through and like you know it's always fun to just watch like someone like dominate an entire set 3-0 across the board. But right. these sets like those that like, they they kind of like they kind of keep you talking. Yeah. So okay. So so the two of you, final thoughts on this. Overall, all all the sets were amazing. Shout outs to like. Frost and Skarm for putting on an amazing set, and Frost, I mean, Frost putting on the reset, yeah. Yeah. And many of, like, the other things that happened during this, like, tournament, I honestly appreciate commentating for you guys again. Thank you for letting me be here. I was going to say, it's good to be back. I was, I know yeah. I was gone for a little bit. Yeah. E even though I had some technical difficulties, it was fun, like, commentating through, like, everything. But overall, yeah, it was really fun. I appreciate it. Yeah. Ta uh, yep. Taco, what, what's, your, uh, what's your final thought? Um... So apparently we're supposed to be moving up the entry cap pretty soon. Yeah, I think right? I think that'll make things uh, a lot more uh, dynamic in terms of like uh, results and like. Why uh, would it be twenty five instead of twenty four? It's twenty twenty four. It's twenty four. Yeah, it's twenty four. Oh, okay. Don't worry about it. Yeah. But yeah, but, um, as you were saying, I was like that would definitely make the bracket turnouts like a lot more uh, dynamic because you know there's like more people, so obviously there's more like opportunities for. Those sorts of like upsets that we've already been seeing we'll just be seeing like more of what we've seen but i mean kind of goes without saying on a much larger scale so that'll be yeah. interesting to watch uh, and hopefully we can see new names too yeah that's true so, that's true so for uh for anon and taco waffle i am bonanza saying so long from Whoa. gilbert arizona uh <laughs> let's see here the baby taking the finals you can watch all all, all these vods on on demand at, at the sak Gaming, uh, 
YouTube channel and all here right here on Twitch. We'll see you next Wednesday uh, for the pilot program. Um, and uh, yeah, <laughs> have a nice have a nice one, everyone. Have a great night. Have a great night, everyone. Well, GG's. Not, not a bad show.